And the August long weekend means school is not that far off. Learning math and science and English, all part of every elementary school's curriculum, but how the basics are taught can make a big difference. The early grades set the foundation for later learning, and one Victoria school is making sure its students soak up as much information as possible by using interactive technology in the classroom. A News reporter Aaron Glazier has more. The sun is shining on the smart board in Mrs. Blue's grade one class, a tool in her teaching arsenal that's making a world of difference for her students. Kids having that aha moment and they just connect and it's, it just honestly sends shivers down my back. The chalk is gone and even the whiteboard's days are numbered. Today, a computer software program projects digital lessons on a similar surface. Good, we get to do some matching. Tegan, Willie, Maya and Ryan are hands-on when learning about butterfly life cycles and spelling out scrambled words. We don't usually get to write on it. With a smart board, we can do it, mostly anything we want on it. Like, they put, she puts on a lot of good activities. Come September 1st, every classroom at Christchurch Cathedral will be equipped with a smart board, despite some initial hesitation from teachers. A couple of years ago, there was concern about it and, you know, where do we do with this? Are we going to be expected to use it? Now they can't wait to get their hands on them so, cause, because they've seen them in action. As first grade curriculums move towards preparing students for 21st century jobs. We're adding and we're um, supplementing and creating because they are in a digital world. The smart board operating systems can cost anywhere from $1,500 to $5,000 and because Mrs. Blue doesn't want her children touching the screens by hand, she allows them to use these magic wands instead. Four, five, hey, wonderful job. The notebook software is used across BC, allowing teachers to share lesson plans and while minor changes are made from year to year, these programs will be around for grades to come. The guts of it are staying the same and they're just getting better and better with integration with audio and visual and, uh, and, and just com coming up with new and better ways to help engage the kids. I think we're getting an A on this test, you guys. <laughs> Who wants to put a number in there? <laughs> hey, that's not part of the lesson plan. <laughs> but having fun while learning is. The kids feel it, I feel it, and I think the parents feel it as well because the learning is that much more engaged and um, effective. And at this age, that's what school and the smart board is all about. In Victoria, Erin Glazier, A News.